is my boy Heraculo. He's got some sweet Occidentals. Look at these guys, man. <laughs> They're used. Are these are the seven uh, the seven bag framers, correct? Yeah. Let's take a look at this side. Yep, he's got the triple pouch. Hell yeah, I like that pouch. It's a good one. Oh, yeah. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Nomad King Channel. I'm James Showers, of course, cleanest name in the biz. Who's and today, to? the people of YouTube. Why? What's for? Well, we're gonna talk about uh, getting around worksite restrictions on music, so they can still rock out. Why don't you put your PPE on? My PPE. <sighs> Fine. All right, everybody. As you can see. We got some jellyfish up on the screen now, and I've got my protective equipment on so we can continue this video. I don't know how many of you out there have the fever, and I can't take any precautions. So, we got this little box here of a couple little things that we're going to talk about so we can continue uh, rocking out on the job site without, uh, you know, the contractor giving us any uh, crap. So... Let's go ahead and get a nicer, closer look of this. We'll take it to the table. Let's go. All right, we got you guys on the table here. What I have is a box with a few items inside. Now these aren't both from the same brand. The box is for this little device right here. And what this is gonna do is gonna allow you to connect to your phone via Bluetooth. And it's going to give you a uh, headphone jack to put these nifty little guys in. So as you can see, they look basically identical to uh, any kind of earplug you're going to need to wear on a commercial job site. Now most commercial job sites don't allow you to um, play music, right? And that normally is somewhat disappointing for people that like to listen to music while they work a lot of people feel like it gives them more uh, you know motivation or the day goes by quicker so let me try getting this thing out of here real quick there we go uh, this is a little device and it has a clip here so you can clip it on to something now what I'd suggest if you're on one of these commercial job sites is you're probably gonna take and uh, buy some velcro and put a little bit of Velcro on this side and then put a little Velcro on the inside of your hard hat. And then this guy will clip up inside your hard hat. Uh, probably towards the back of it, on the inside obviously. And then you'd connect this and run a few wires down the back so you can put these in your um, ears. <clears throat> You'll have to connect this to your phone via Bluetooth and uh, this is the way for you to change songs and raise volume. I believe you're able to probably change songs on your phone without grabbing this each time. But, um, and you can probably change the volume from your phone as well, but this will be, I don't know if it'll be an actual boost to your, uh, I don't think it'll like boost the sound of your phone, but it'll definitely regulate whether or not it's loud or not. So I'd suggest cranking this one all the way up and using the controls on your phone. It's gonna be a little easier to get to. Now they send you this adapter right here that will connect to this device and charge it. Um, I believe you can get a full day use out of this. Um, it's been a while since I've used one and especially now that I'm putting this video out I probably shouldn't use one because uh, you know safety guru, guru might be watching this right now. What is this about? This is some kind of mail-to-mail -mail connector. I'm assuming you're able to connect this to a different device. Maybe like a little speaker or something. So they throw in this little adapter and then of course they give you some instructions of what or what not. Love you. Anywhere. Anytime. Damn, they sold me just on the slogan below, uh, alone. But uh, let's take a comparison between uh, like a look of what these he, uh, these earplug headphones look like compared to regular set of earplugs from the job. Okay, this is a pair of your standard earplugs from a job site. Uh, some of them actually do look just like these. This is the only pair that I could get for this presentation. 
but they do look pretty close not too many people are going to question it if they see some blue coming down and some yellow and blue in your ear right so this is one way for you to get by anybody um, asking whether or not you're listening to music because it'll look like you're you know just rocking a pair of a pair of uh, earplugs to keep the noise um, the noise down noise reducted so I've opened up the booklet here and it's gonna tell us a few things it's gonna tell us the frequency range right here and we're gonna be between 2.4 and uh, 2.48 gigahertz it's not a really huge frequency but uh, I mean it's I don't know 2.402 to 2.480 so I don't know maybe there's a range there let me know in the comments down below frequency response maybe that's the better that's a 20 gigahertz to 20 gigahertz okay so yes there's not very big range here battery life they're saying that's gonna be about two to three hours to charge and you'll get about six to four to six hours of music and this also has a feature where you can take calls so it was saying you like hold and you press for a second and you can use your speaker so this earplug does not have a set of speakers or a microphone on this set of earplugs so you couldn't use this feature um, you could if you're doing something else I'm sure they weren't planning on anyone using this with a pair of these so that you can get past a um, no radio claws on the job but if you are using that talk feature like say you do find these with a microphone on them you'll only get um, 3.5 hours of speak time on here but you will get it says uh, four to six hours of music so that's pretty good you know you could probably keep the volume down and get probably closer to that six um, yeah let me know what you guys think about this little guy here. Have you guys ever tried this before? Um, have you been looking for a way to get around the no music on the job site? And uh, all that good stuff. I will be putting the links for both these items down in the description. And maybe a few more links of uh, other items. Because there's a lot of different Bluetooth receivers out there on Amazon and in wherever this is just uh, one of the cheaper ones that I found I didn't really want to put too much money into this whole project and there's a few different series of these there's a uh, like a first gen and a second gen and I and there probably is one with a microphone on it they do come with a couple different ends ones that are orange foam the ones that you can press and they'll um, inflate back in your ears and ones like this where they have the tri i don't know what that is tri flap i don't know you let me know in the comments down below but uh thank you for joining me again today in the lockdown corner and uh i'll see you guys in the next video oh man the video is finally done can i take this crap off holy You gotta stay safe. Listen, they made it to where if you're gonna go back to work on the construction job, you're gonna have a mask. We're gonna be talking about that in an upcoming video. Like, share, subscribe. I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace. Uh, oh, wow, it does. Is that a speaker? Maybe, maybe not. No, <clears throat> I'll have to cut that out. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the Nomad King channel. I'm James Shower, cleanest name in the biz, and today, today we're gonna be talking about. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, man, I'm so sorry. Whoever's out there watching me on YouTube, I guess. Why? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Why? What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the Nomadic King channel. I'm James Showers, cleanest name in the biz, and today we're going to be talking about... Oh, I'm sorry! <laughs> oh, man, I'm so sorry.